bouncing out. What did you see on the, uh, you had a nice uh, rebound and, and dunk with about eight minutes to go when things were really tight. Yeah. You, I don't think you guys trailed again after that. What did you see on that play? Did it just did it open up or what? Uh, Jay, you went with the lefty floater, and um, I was I was going to jump whether it went in or not just to, you know, in case it came off and it ricocheted right, you know, over over to the left of me, but I tried to corral it and put it in. So, uh, big play, and um, like you said, we didn't we didn't trail after that, so big momentum change. Playing four, you know, four games in six days. I mean, how do you feel the team as a whole responded? A couple overtime games in there too. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, two overtimes and four games in six days. Sunday was a heck of a travel day for us, and. Um, yeah, you know, nobody complained. Um, you didn't. You didn't hear any negativity out of you know why it took so long to get home, and uh, you know no negativity. And it's just we were just happy to play. And you know, obviously you're on national TV. You got a crowd like that. You're not going to be tired for that. So in the second half, when they went to that zone, you guys yeah. made cutters through it, dribble penetration, mm -hmm. just screened it a little bit. I mean, yeah. it's not a good blueprint. You guys don't need just a long range shooter. You can bust a zone in a lot of ways. Yeah, and I mean everyone was dogging us for our three-point shooting and I look up and would we shoot 51 percent from three or something like that so um, I hope people aren't writing how we can't shoot the three anymore we got a bunch of shooters on this team we got a bunch of playmakers and um, we showed that tonight you know we attacked the zone we attacked their man and it was just a great game on both sides